Hello my single Aquarians, this is Deborah, and this is going to be a new series that will tack on to the end of the previous series I put out in January, Single Soulmate Energy, now through until the end of this year. So guys, thank you for being here and thank you so much for your support. i um, just gone over 200,000, so thank you so, so much from me. This is my love to you. <laughs> okay, let's get into this using an angel or reports to help me channel through the advice from the divine and Archangel Michael is with us. Let's get into this and Archangel Michael, can we please start with a keyword or phrase from you for my Aquarians? Thank you, Michael. Wow. Aquarius, I'm hearing 180, 180, you're doing a 180, you're going back to someone, you're wanting to work on a connection with someone from your past. Now, this could be someone that you met a few months ago, it could be a few years ago, but you're definitely looking back, and Michael is telling me with a greater sense of interest, more interest than previously. Okay, interesting. All right. Let's just see what comes through. Michael's saying, stop my cue to cut the deck. Okay. Just taking three cards, Aquarius. This is the energy between the two of you. Could signify the person that you are wanting to return to. We'll see what comes through. Okay. Now moving into Twin Flame Journey Tarot, brand new deck by Mystic Moon. So Archangel Michael, a couple of cards. Wow, that wanted to come through. Thank you. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's laughing at me. Okay. Mm, very, very strong energy, Aquarius. Between you and whoever you want to return to. Okay, Archangel Michael, two cards from the Romance Angels. Thank you. Two cards from the Romance Angels. All right. I keep hearing wanting to go back. I just want to go back. I want to go back. I want to go back. Something's not finished. Something's not finished. Okay, tis done. Let's move into this and see what comes through okay guys starting off with this energy here all right four of wands in the reverse wow so aquarius you could have ended a long-term situation with someone to return to somebody from the past or you are wondering whether or not you actually want to move into and i'm hearing another long-term commitment you may not be sure or you may be still in a situation where you're needing to sell a property in order to finalise a long-term situation to go back to somebody else. Now, for some of you, this is you preparing for Twin Flame Union, 11-11, okay? Not quite there, not quite yet. This could be something that you're working on. Aquarius, a lot of fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, you could have fire predominantly in your natal chart or you are ending a situation with a fire sign or wanting to relight the fire with a fire sign from your past four of pentacles in the reverse opening up and i'm hearing opening up to love no longer standing back in the shadows kind of waiting watching someone you're no longer so stressed about your finances. It could be that you've held on to a long-term situation for quite a while, maybe for financial security, and you're now realizing, I really don't wanna be here anymore. I'm letting this go. Now, you could also be preparing to open up to someone for a conversation, quite, Michael's saying, quite an important conversation. Yeah, look at that, wow. Two fours, you're stabilizing your energy, three fours. Now, three fours are 12, one and two is three, change. So you're stabilizing yourself and you are preparing for major change. You have been healing from heartbreak. 
in a very difficult situation. You're now ready to take action. Now, for you Aquarians out there, this could very well be your person's energy. So they could be ending a situation, preparing to move forwards towards you. I'm getting a sense of healing, healing and opening up, sorting out your finances. Okay, preparing for the new, preparing for the new, but definitely somebody coming back from the past. A very strong indication that someone here is letting go of a long term commitment to return to somebody from their past. Let's have a look at Twin Flame Journey Tarot. Okay, Ten of Swords. Yeah, this flipped out. For some of you, you have gone through a very painful ending of a long term commitment. For some of you, the person that you will be connecting with has gone through a difficult ending and you may be sitting waiting for them to be healed enough to move forwards towards you. Page of Swords. A lot of air energy, Aquarius, which of course is you, so this could very well be your energy. You're thinking, Page of Swords, thinking about reaching out. This is the energy, though, of very little emotion. This is communicating about facts. So this could be you communicating to someone that you are with, that you want to detach. You're ready to detach. You've hung on to this for too long. There's not a lot of love energy here, Aquarius. This could very well be you ending a situation or the person who's going to be moving forward towards you ending a situation. Okay. They could be right in the middle of this right now. Or they may have emotionally released their partner and now dealing with the practicalities of ending a situation. Okay. All right. All right. Honeymoon. Now, for me, I have to say, I, I would love to say, yes, you guys are going to sail off into the sunset together. But no, I feel this is someone relocating, moving. I think someone is healing, taking a break after a painful ending. Yeah, somebody here is definitely ending a situation and is trying to clear their energy in order to be healed enough to move forward towards somebody from their past. It's a very strong energy. So Aquarius, you could be reconnecting with someone who is a fellow air sign, a lot of air energy here, or an earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Could also be fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, preparing for reunion with a fire sign, maybe. Maybe you realise now that you met your twin flame. That is a twin card. And you are in the process of releasing someone else in order to be with that person. Beautiful energy. But for some of you, this is you needing to take the time to heal. For others of you who are waiting for this person to come in, they do need time. They need time to get themselves emotionally stable again in order for a new connection, maybe from the past, to be successful. Aquarius, I'm going to leave it there. I hope that this reading has been helpful to you. Sending much love and light your way. Take care of you and I'll be back very soon for your next set of readings. Bye now.